this is a topic that you really love. But first, I want to say, you know, talk to our users and say, thank you for watching another episode of uh, Driving with Ty. Really appreciate your support. Really appreciate your views. Um, one thing I wanted to talk to you about, and I need you to like kind of explain to me, is this whole like coupon craze, like those coupon shows where the people go in. Like, how does how does that work? Oh, I mean, it baffles me, you know, because I don't live in a state, you know, that uh, gives you the opportunity to save, uh, to save like that. You know, everything is like in a box you know it's, it's like these are the coupons you're getting and that's it you know one per customer per purchase all that stuff's like you know the fine print but a lot of these people are living in states you know like a seattle washington where you know you can go in and clip like you know 60 coupons worth of like you know power aid you know you can get like a card of card of power aid for free mm. you know one of those like extreme coupon and shows um oh so so they and, okay yeah i mean so if it's on sale for like 99 cents and they have a coupon that's for like 50 cents and their supermarket doubles it that's a dollar they're leaving the store oh, not paying anything for the power so, aid. okay so, so so it's like it's like accelerators and bonuses and all that stuff and yeah yeah all okay. that stuff and, and maryland doesn't give you the opportunity to keep using keep using keep using or give you 20 coupons or something oh. you gotta use one or you gotta use you know they're very specific, and um, you know, if that was the case, if they, you know, things did change, then yeah, I probably would be one of those people that would be like, I'm getting this stuff for free or next to nothing. But you know, it's, it's set up in such a way that it is not for the consumer to, to ex- extreme save. You can save, but not to an extreme. I got you. So. Okay. So, so the one thing that I did realize, a lot of people don't realize this, is that uh, coupons don't just save you face uh, face value. Um, they actually do allow you to stretch your dollars. And uh, I think a real simple example is like, um, let's say you had like you go to like a CVS or whatever, and you pick up something for ten bucks, right? Mm-hmm. Let's say you pick up like um, I don't know, you, you got contacts and you pick up like like the Bausch and Lomb like um, eye rinse or whatever, Johnson Johnson, whatever, just some eye rinse, <laughs> something for your eyes. You know, because, you know, your your eyes get irritated. It's something you need. It's essential. But because, uh, let's say, Bausch & Lomb wants to, like, keep your business, they're going to give you, like, a dollar off coupon. So let's say uh-huh. you originally spend 10 bucks, and your uh, coupon is for a dollar off. Let's say you walk in the store and you don't use the coupon. So you got to pay the 10 bucks plus you got to pay, in Maryland, it's 6 cents, a uh, 6% intro, um, 6% a tax. So that's six cents on every dollar. So that would be sixty cents. So you would end up paying ten sixty because of tax for that particular yeah. uh, bottle of like solution or whatever. So now let's run it with the idea that you take off that dollar. So now what happens is you uh, say ten dollars minus the one dollar for your coupon uh-huh. is now nine dollars. So then you go and say like, "Hey, I need to take ten. I need to take six percent of that." So it's really six times nine, which is fifty-four cents. So now, if you say ten six, well, I'm, I'm sorry. Let me let me step let me step back. I'm jumping ahead. So if you take the nine dollars plus the fifty-four cents yeah. that you had to pay, so then you say like, "Okay, what's ten sixty minus?" Nine fifty-four. Uh-huh. That's a dollar and six cents. So you actually spent, you actually spent a dollar and six cents less. So really, what's happening is for every dollar that you save in coupons, you actually save not only that dollar but also tax because they take it off before they charge. They take the coupon value before. Mm-hmm. So it's like pre, it's like uh, pre-tax. Right. So. A lot of people don't realize that, and that's the that's the benefit of actually, you know, buying coupons. And, or actually, I'm sorry, not buying coupons, but actually using coupons, because you actually do save when you can use those coupons. You actually do save uh, that cost in tax. And so that's um that's actually pretty powerful. I didn't realize that because within a within like a year, if you save like a hundred dollars on coupons. Yeah. You know, it's like, like, how much did you save? It's like, 
a hundred times whatever this tax is, and it's, that's like like sixty bucks, I think, or something, or like or six bucks. I don't know. It's, but it, it's it's a savings. But um, a lot of people don't realize that. Yeah. And, you know, it, I mean, I I think it's cool, but I mean, it is effort. You know, to really say like I need to go and like clip out these coupons. The like, you know, is it really worth your 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 time? For, for certain people, I mean, I, I think if you can actually get a nice clip going, and a lot of times they're in the they're in the paper, and it's in, a lot of times it's like they're in the paper, they're online, you can go look them up, and it's helping you stretch your dollars, and and I think that's very important in a time like this. You know, our economy isn't terrible, but it isn't great, and people are trying to find ways to stretch dollars, and I think that's one way that you could stretch dollars is by taking a little time. You know, maybe you're watching TV, maybe you're doing something else. Just go and clip a couple coupons, and the next time right. you go to the store, use it. You know, it's really minimum amount of effort. And then you get people that can, like, just totally, like, like bend the system to their will, which is fantastic. But, you know, that's, you know, kind of crazy. But, you know, I wonder what our, our viewers, viewers think. Um, you know, what do you... You know, feel about coupons like is it a waste of time are they useful do you like them so look forward to your responses